finding the general rule of a sequence. Okay, note that this process applies only to the sequences whose nature is linear. If the difference is constant, we use the equation a times n plus b equals a of n in finding the general rule of the sequence. So, ano bang ibig sabihin ng constant? For example, we have here the sequence 9, 18, 27, 36, 45. Let us find the common difference. To find the common difference, isusubtract lang natin yung 18 minus 9, we have 9. 27 minus 18, 9. 36 minus 27, 9. 45 minus 36, 9. Napansin nyo, puro siya 9. Hindi siya nagbabago. Yun ang ibig sabihin ng constant. So, ibig sabihin, ang constant difference niya ay 9. So, the difference is constant. Example number 1. Find the general rule of the sequence 5, 8, 11, 14, 17. Solution. Let us first create a table of A's of N and N values. So, we have here 5 terms, kaya ang N natin ay 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Sunod-sunod yan. Kung ang first term mo ay 5, nandun siya sa ilalim ng 1. So, N is 2, second term is 8. If N is 3, the third term is 11. If n is 4, the fourth term is 14. And if n is 5, the fifth term is 17. Ngayon, kunin natin ang kanilang difference. 8 minus 5, 3. 11 minus 8, 3. 14 minus 11, 3. And 17 minus 14, 3. So, ayan. Ang common difference niya ay 3. Balikan natin yung general equation kanina. So, dapat kapag nanonood ka ng lesson natin ngayon, dapat mayroon ka dyang notebook at ball pen at nagtetake take notes ka. So, ano ba yung general equation natin kanina? A times N plus B is equals to A of N. Next step, we will form two equations. Meron tayong equation number 1 at equation number 2. Doon muna tayo sa equation number 1. If your N is equals to 1, the first term is 5. So, from the general equation, A times N plus B is equals to A of N, we will substitute N and A of 1. So, we have now A times 1 plus B is equals to 5. The equation now is A plus, 5 plus B is equals to 5. Yan ang equation number 1. Paano yung equation number 2? Ganun din. If n is equals to 2, the second term is 8. From the general equation, a times n plus b is equals to a sub n, substitute natin, we have now a times 2 plus b is equals to 8. Therefore, the second equation is 2a plus b is equals to 8. O, take notes kayo before I will proceed to the next slide. Kailangan kopyahin nyo kung ano yung equation number 1 natin at equation number 2. We will solve using 
systems of linear equation by elimination method. Ano ba yung equation number 2 natin? 2a plus b is equal to 8. Our equation number 1 is a plus b is equals to 5. Tatanungin nyo, bakit po parang may minus doon? Kasi, isusubtract natin ang equation number 1 sa equation number 2. 2a minus a is a. 8 minus 5 is 3. b minus b, 0 or we can cancel. So, nakuha natin na ang value ng a ay 3. Substitute the value of a is equals to 3 in either equation 1 or equation 2. Pipili ka ngayon. Pero kahit ano sa dalawang equation, pwede mong piliin. So, for example, parang mas simple naman yung equation number 1. So, piliin natin ang equation number 1. A plus B is equal to 5. Substitute natin ang A. So, we have now 3 plus B is equal to 5. Therefore, B is equal to 5 minus 3 or B is equal to 2. Meron na tayong value ng A at value ng B. Substitute the value of A and B in the general equation. Ano ba yung general equation natin? A times N plus B is equal to A of N. Substitute natin. So, we have now 3 times N plus 2 is equal to A of N. 3N plus 2 equals A of N. So, ang ating general rule ngayon ay A of N is equal to 3N plus 2. Let us check if our answer is correct by substituting the values. Tingnan natin. So, we have A of N is equal to 3N plus 2. If N is equal to 1, A of 1 is equals to 3 times 1 plus 2 equals 5. Ayun, 5. So, if n is equals to 2, a of 2 is equals to 3 times 2 plus 2. 3 times 2 is 6 plus 2, 8. Then, we have a of 3 is 3 times 3, 9 plus 2 equals 11. A of 4 is 3 times 4, 12, plus 2 equals 14. And A of 5 is 3 times 5, 15, plus 2 equals 17. So, ayan. So, ibig sabihin, yung nakuha nating sagot sa general rule ay tama. The general rule is A of N equals 3N plus 2. Thank you for watching. This is Teacher Nati saying, Let us thank God for all the blessings that He has given you.